friends here in this video we will see a problem on moment of inertia of a circle and for that here we have a question calculate the mi about any tangent that is moment of inertia about any tangent of a circle having 400 mm radius so i'll draw the diagram so here we have a circle circle having radius 400 mm so the diameter will be 800 mm next here if we look into the question then here i have x axis and the tangent which i have taken it is parallel to x we can solve it by using the tangent parallel to y also in that way also it is correct and we have to calculate the mi about any tangent so the question is we have to find moment of inertia about this tangent ab so now let us try to get this solution here i can see that the tangent ab is parallel to x axis so we can use parallel axis theorem because that theorem is used when we have to calculate moment of inertia about any axis which is parallel to the centroidal axis here xx is passing through centroid so it becomes centroidal axis so now here i'll say that since by parallel axis theorem mi about ab that is the tangent of a circle is given by i suffix ab we know that by parallel axis theorem it is i suffix ab is equal to i x x because ab is parallel to x axis i x x plus area into h square now what is h h is the distance between the two axes that is the axis on which we want to calculate mi and to which it is parallel so here i have distance h so therefore i suffix ab is equal to we know that i x x for a circle it is pi by 64 diameter is to 4 plus area area of a circle pi by 4 d square into h now it is clearly seen that h is nothing but the distance from the center up to ab so it is equal to the radius so it is radius square so finally i'll go on putting the values i ab will be equal to pi by 64 the diameter is 800 here in case of moment of inertia it is pi by 64 d raised to 4 so it is 800 raised to 4 and it is pi by 4 d square that is the area radius is 400 so it is h square and finally i a b the value comes out to be 1 into 10 raised to 11 mm raised to 4 so this is the answer so as we have seen when they were asking to calculate the mi about any tangent of a circle which was given we have found out the answer and with this we complete the question